you're going through some of the most magnificent wilderness on the face of the planet, uh, but there are also great dangers. There were many times I wondered, what have I done? You know, is this irresponsible? It, should I have brought my daughter up here? When we were on the river, on the Hula Hula River, she was the bowman in the canoe. And the bowman picks the line on the river and dictates the strokes. So my dad had told me what my job would be beforehand. Um, so when I was going through, I was, you know, giving small suggestions and I kind of weakly say, well, I think pedal on the left, pedal on the left. But, you know, I was still, most of my trust was in my dad to tell me what to do. And he tried yelling over the rapids and, Aiden, do this, do that. You know, over the roar of the river. I couldn't hear anything. My, my eyes were, and my instincts were telling me to go one way. He was telling me to go the other. And it was just a disaster. The next morning I said, Dad, you're going to have to trust me. I'm not going to get all of them right. And I didn't, but I know what I see. I learned to shut up and to trust her. And that was incredibly hard. It was a complete role reversal. Every parent grapples with the, the conflict between kind of loving their children, you know, and letting that kid go. That's the hardest thing in the world to do. And so I did get some things wrong, but I improved. And by the end, I was shouting back to him and I was the boss of the canoe. And he was just, he was taking my orders. It was actually a little bit fun too. I mean, to get the chance to yell at your dad is, is you don't often get that chance.